Howdy folks, this is Cody with GameCam.net coming at you with a very special video. It's the special demo version of Mighty Number no. 9 that was just released for all the game's backers. Way back in the day, I did back this, so here we go. I only briefly tried this just to make sure my setup was working. I haven't actually played it for more than a few seconds, nor have I watched any of these cutscenes, so we'll watch these together. Breakthroughs in robotic technology instead of your 20XX. Because it's already 20XX. <laughs> Violence is confined to the Battle Coliseum, where robot combatants face off in spectacular duels. Today... I'll probably be relatively quiet during a lot of this, just so you can see this. And because I haven't seen it either. Dr. Wiley! Of course not. He's registered trademark. There's Beck. So it just starts out there. There's, I figured there'd be a little more backstory, but I'm cool with this. It's not like Mega Man had much more backstory. Go. Professor. Ah, oh, Beck, and functioning normally, it would appear. What on earth has happened? It's chaos. His fro. Instead of Dr. Light. We must make for the laboratory. And quickly. Beck, you forge ahead and clear a secure path. I'll follow and monitor your progress. I figured he would have been older. Yes, sir. Guess I should have kept up a little more on the uh, art from the webpage. They've been sending us updates pretty much nonstop since the initial backing. But there are so many and I have so much else going. I don't always get to read them all. I do save them all, though, so I guess I can go back and look at them. Once again, the president has declared... The president looks like Rufus Shinra. This based on reports of haywire robots rampaging out of control in all 52 states. Sound only. Does that mean there's going to be actual FMV during the real game? Cherry Dine, of course, being the world's leading robot manufacturer. Let's go there now, live. Attention. Oh, that's Attention. not the president. Is this thing on? <clears throat> My fellow American. Oh, maybe it is. I don't know. We at Cherry Dine would just like to express that this isn't our fault. It's that Dr. Blackwell. He's the one behind this. Blame him. Well played, Mr. Graham. We at Cherry Dine are doing all we can to help fix the situation. I think you're a liar, sir. Hello, is this thing on? Avi? <clears throat> and now let's go live to our eye in the sky, Avi, for today's Avi News Traffic Report. Thanks, Avi. As you can see, we've got a few accidents eastbound on, well, everywhere! <laughs> Graphics are pretty good. Who's this? Uh oh. Just a security bot. It's out of control. Regular bad guy looks like. There's no other way. You need to fight. He really looks out of control, Doctor. What he's just standing there looking around. Meanwhile I murder an innocent robot. I'll do it. Ugh. It's not dead apparently. I can't shoot now after I touched it. Um, I'm not sure what happened. I can't shoot. I can't progress. When I touch it, I take damage. Okay. 
Is this a glitch? Um. Uh. I think the game glitched. I mean, I know this is a demo, but I was kind of hoping it wouldn't glitch this early. That guy seems to be in suspended animation. Well, let's see if I can die. <sighs> well, this is a bit frustrating. His death is cool. I mean, it'll take all of a second to get back here. Literally sad that I had to die on the first enemy in the game, but, uh, you know, it's not necessarily like I had a choice there. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Can't skip it. Ugh. Okay, and skip it hit by hitting option. So it was glitched. Did you just absorb the cells of a weakened robot and my goodness, assimilate them? That's right. Ugh. Is that a bad guy? I guess so. Can he charge like the Mega Buster? Oh, it appears I may be shooting them past their death. Okay, well, this is going to be a pain. Okay, so if you keep shooting them when they're blue, I get it. Can't absorb them. I imagine this will run a tad bit smoother. And I believe I had it reserved for the Wii U or the PlayStation 4. I don't remember which. Hmm. I don't get it. Well, there's no prompt. I may have to rush over. I bet you that's it. Yep, there should have been some sort of prompt for that for the first time, but whatever. It's a gauntlet. Oh! Little garbage robots. Oh, 
Oh! I didn't think they were that close to death. Oh, the shield guys. So, you can absorb them even if they're not blue. It's probably just harder or something? I don't know. Maybe they give you less? Oh boy. Yeah, I could have used that hint earlier. Garbage bots. They're literally garbage bots. Speaking of which, I have my dinner in the oven. It's probably burning at this point. But to finally play a demo of Mighty Number no. 9 and get it up on YouTube, totally worth it. Who cares about dinner? Oh. I'm also a backer for uh, Iga's Bloodstained Ritual of the Night. Can't wait to see some progress on that, too. But, I mean, this one was from way back in the day, so I'm just excited that something came out of it for now. I mean, I guess I do have the uh, Mighty Gun Vault on my 3DS, and soon to be downloaded on Steam. But, you know, as, much, as, as nice as it is to have those bonuses... You really wanted to see the Mighty Number no. 9. And it's a very faithful Mega Man style game. I mean, I'd expect nothing less. That's why I backed it initially. Oop, I accidentally skipped through their conversation. Round digger. There's a slight delay between my jumping and it actually happening. I'm not sure if that's because of my setup or my controller. Did it just heal itself? What a piece of garbage. But it's going to make this a little more difficult. Ugh, I'm gonna lose. Even when I get the jump off in enough time. I'm not entirely sure how slash why it's healing itself or how it can prevent that. It may have to do with my dash, seeing as that's the only other thing I have. I tried that there at the very end, but died. But that could have been I died before it actually connected, or I needed to do it at certain points. Anyway, let's try again. Let's see if there are any hints I may have looked over here. Doesn't look like it. Stats. Is Zell how much it cost? Well, I definitely can't dash through it. At least normally. There we go! I'm behind it now, though.
Huh. Okay, well, I know what to do now. It's just... Staying alive. As soon as I get behind it, it starts dealing damage to me. I may have to dash back through it, like, almost instantaneously. What was that? Yeah, yeah, Dr. White, we know. Well, I wasn't expecting that. He started early this time. Okay, so I do have to dash back out almost instantly. So dashing is key to pretty much everything in this game. Is this how he absorbs powers? Oh, he's making it go back to normal. Sounded like its admission failed. Woohoo! Beat the intro level of Mighty Number no. 9 demo! Yeah, I died two times, but, you know, learning curve and all that. And that is definitely a unique part of the game that is not from the Mega Man series. Or at least, none of the Mega Mans I've played, which is most of them, I think. And there's Call. Sonda, are you all right? Well, back. Thank goodness. Uh, but where are the other mighty numbers? They've gone bad. Evidence. I believe they might be suffering from this robot affliction that's going around. Crikey! Crikey! Bot in America went completely nuts all at once. Let me contact my brother at the head office in Tokyo. Maybe he can send help. Get the Japanese robots over here. We chances are good they're all going nuts. I like how Call's just kind of not doing anything. The Japanese government won't let us intervene until we know the cause of the malfunctions. Guess that makes sense. Don't want your robots to go bad. I was afraid of that, but it makes sense. After all, any robots you send to help could be affected as well, making things even worse. Even worse. Just to confirm, Mr. Sonda, if we can isolate the cause of the robot rampage, we'll send aid? Absolutely, Professor White. Anything we can do. Did you have a plan in mind? Blow the crap out of all the robots yes. with Beck. We'll send Beck to track down all his fellow mighty numbers. Great idea. Wait, Wh what? <laughs> His assimilation ability should filter any irregularities from his siblings' programming. If we can gather and study multiple samples, perhaps we can isolate the cause of the problem. It's a long shot, but it's our only hope. The fate of the entire country hangs in the S balance. Call not going to say anything? Calls so she can oh, well that's why. She's not fully reactivated. We actually voted on a lot of uh, Call's design back in the day. It's kind of cool to know that I had a hand in that. Not to worry, Beck. This is well within your capabilities. New content in extra mode is here. Go ahead and... Attention! New... I'm interrupting everybody. Richard lollygagging. It's up to us to stop those rampaging bots. I like lollygagging. Ah. Hmm. The VR training program I devised. Uh, care to try it? Maybe. Go ahead and choose your next talk. Um, I guess I gotta hit the button to zoom in. New tips are added as the game progresses. Be sure to check back and view them regularly. Here's a question. How do I save? Is it auto-saved? I mean, most games are these days. But you know what's going to happen. I'm going to assume it is. And I'm going to come back and my progress is going to be lost. Remember, 
A lot of options. Return to the title screen. Well, here's what I'm thinking. It should tell me if I'm going to go back and it didn't autosave. Most games will be like, if you leave now, you'll lose any progress. So... Alrighty, folks. I'm going to take a break for now, get this uploaded. I'll come back in a bit and do another part. See you then.